Hey guys, I'm Angela Jean, and if you want to know where your mindset and where your belief is about yourself, pay attention to anything that triggers you. Pay attention to anything that you jump to defend that will tell you exactly what you feel about yourself. Let me share a quick little story. About 25 years ago, that's how much I remember what was said to me. About 25 years ago, a guy friend of mine, we were sitting together at dinner, and he turns to me and he says, Aren't you sick of dumbing yourself down to hang out with the people that you hang out with? But because my mindset at the time was unevolved, I had childhood beliefs carrying me through life, I thought he called me dumb. All I heard was, aren't you dumb? Not, aren't you sick of dumbing yourself down to hang out with the people you hang out with? Our entire lives are processed through our own filters of belief, our own perceptions about ourselves. It doesn't matter what people say to us. We are gonna hear it through the filter that we feel about ourselves. How I embrace this belief about myself and how I embrace this mindset is the woman that raised me had education on top of education on top of education. She knew I was smart, but I chose the arts. I liked music, I liked dance. And so every time I would come home after I left home, we would be at dinner and she'd be like, oh, you could have done so much with your life. It was always this like pity. Oh, I can't believe you did this. And she'd be like, you were so smart. As if intelligence is something that leaves you. So I had this belief. So when my friend said, aren't you sick of dumbing yourself down to hang out with your friends? I didn't hear that he was actually calling me smart. All I heard was, are you dumb? All I heard was dumb. All I heard was dumb. I filtered that word out and that's what the mind does. That's what your belief does. It puts a filter over everything you hear and everything you see and that is why it is imperative that you identify these triggers and work on your beliefs. So the next time someone triggers you, instead of getting mad and wanting to jump to defend yourself and be reactive, take that moment. You have to emotionally calibrate yourself. Most people, when they're triggered, do two things. They either react and attack the person or suppress it and push it down. And that does nothing with the trigger. That does nothing with the belief. Every time it rushes to the surface, it's basically saying, hey, I'm still in here. You want to talk? And you're not doing that. So learn to embrace your triggers. Embrace the people that trigger you. Thank you for showing me where I am still stuck. Thank you for showing me where my belief system needs to be worked on. Thank you for showing me where I'm not free. Thank you for showing me where I'm not healed. That needs to be your mindset anytime you are triggered. If you like this content, follow for more.